in lane number six. Ends 100 meters backstroke S8 classification. Of course, we see there are a variety of different starts. A number of these athletes having uh, problems with their lower limbs, so big up and quickly into their strokes with strong arm pulls. And as we can see, as expected, Robert Griswold's going for it, but he's not having it all his own way down this first 50 metres. He's not. It's lane four and five there. Robert Griswold is closest to us of those two, and he will lead going in to the halfway point here. Robert Griswold, he's got this one in control. He has a lead of around about a second or so over Carlo Maggio in second position. It's Matt Maliar in third here, but Robert Griswold stretching away. Yeah, Robert was really, really commanding this race now as we come into the final 25 metres. It's his, he's, he's going for, we can see he's got a small kick, not getting much propulsion from his legs, but he's very well balanced. He's worked really hard and he's used Rio 2016 as a platform to keep improving and he's going to take this opportunity to get his first gold medal. Here he comes into the final stages now. Griswold will take the first gold for the USA. 104.17. Well, very, very close to his best time. In second position, it's Carlo Maggio from Argentina and Mark Malia from Israel. Well, that's a good swim from him. 113.76 to get in for the bronze medal position. But it was Robert Griswold really all the way there. He went out very, very fast. And Robert Griswold, he was the favourite and didn't disappoint. He knew he had an opportunity, we kept saying that, and you can only really race who's in the water at the time. He made the most of that, and time's difficult to deal with at this time of the year because of the rescheduling, but ultimately you've got to get your hand on that wall first. We actually see there Mark Malia of the Israel out in lane six. He used, made the best use of that underwater, and it helped him to come and steal that bronze medal ball ahead of the two Argentinians but by the time it got to this stage around about halfway down there it looked like it was going to be Robert Griswold all the way in this S8 100 backstroke and yeah Griswold has delivered great way to start the meet there that'll give him a lot of confidence going into the other events result is confirmed Robert Griswold wins the gold medal in the men's 100 backstroke S8 ahead of Carlo Maggio and Mark Mann.